Hey there everyone, what's up? And welcome back to another video on Film Central. If you happen to be a die-hard fan of the Dance Mom show, this piece of hard reality might not suit you that well. But on the other hand, if you're looking out for the truth about the Dance Mom's cast, then here are four points for you to ponder on. The cast members are faking it all. This might come as a surprise to a lot of the fans who truly believe in the competitive spirit that prevailed in the show, but come on, no one could deny the fact that even with so much training and practice, there were just so many tip-offs for people to see just how fake the entire show was. Some people were purposefully asked to lose, and others were made winners by the script the producers handed over to their production team. I definitely believe that a lot of dance moms would want this to be fake, and they supposedly could have discarded all these statements if they were the ones making them. But the fact is, so many actors and dancers came out and explained the fakeness in the show, where they explicitly made it clear that the entire show was according to a plan designed out by people behind the scenes. Amongst the dancers who came out and spoke on the issue of dance moms being staged are Chloe and Christy. And anyone who sees their audience sessions would clearly start wondering if there's actually anything other than fake in this reality TV show. The contact numbers of Dance Mom competitions are all fake. Speaking of the fakeness that prevails in the Dance Mom show, it should not come as a surprise that the contact numbers given in the posters of the Dance Mom competitions are all fake. Don't just take it from us, go try them out yourself. A lot of ex-actors actually exposed this truth, and then, when people started trying it out, they came to know that the people behind Dance Moms staged the entire thing, and just to add some sort of real touch to the show, they give out fake numbers so that people would think as if they were watching a show anyone could join, while the reality is quite contrary to that. The producers of Dance Moms actually look for cast members just like any other TV show does, and it barely has to do much with the real talent each dancer has. As 14 years old, we got the opportunity to start filming ourselves daily. The idea to give a The cast members' moves were scripted. If you do not believe us, at least listen to what Peyton has to say about this. She explicitly states that they are clearly told what to do, which means what you see on the show is not them being them, but it's just a version of them being portrayed by the producers and the directors who control Dance Moms. Therefore, if you really wish to know about who these cast members really are, it will be far better for you to look into videos they post personally. Dance Moms producers control everything that airs on their show. Therefore, you seriously cannot judge any actor by just looking at how this person acted. For instance, Peyton was asked to snap after a dance competition at her dance mates because the producers thought it would look good. So when everyone started hating Peyton because of how she acted, it wasn't really her who was snapping. Rather, it was a version of her being portrayed by the production team. And I said, absolutely. And so I said that and they edited it and made it seem like I was saying it about the girl. Hey, hold up. Before we move to number one, do us a favor and please subscribe to the channel. And don't forget to hit the bell icon so that you don't miss out on any of our videos. All right, let's move on to the finale. The Dance Moms cast does not part ways on good terms. Another sad yet truth based on factuality is that Dance Moms cast does not part ways on good terms most of the time. And this usually happens due to the fact that the production team generally pits them against each other in the show, which then shows its color in real life. So they would be following each other on social media and stuff, but they wouldn't really be as cool as they were supposed to be. The sad part over here is that this causes some really good friendships to break apart, which in itself is a very sad thing indeed. We're not as close as we were before the show happened, and I guess because of all the drama, even though it was kind of sad. A simple way of rechecking the claims is by rewatching the show and looking closely at everything that goes by. Or you can listen to what ex-actors have to say about what they all had witnessed during their time working at the Dance Moms. Well, this brings us to the end of our video. Hope you guys enjoyed it. If you haven't liked the video yet, it's never too late to like it now. 
give it a thumbs up, people. We'll see you soon in another video. Until then, take care and goodbye.